Hello and welcome to First Aid For You. I'm Cheryl and in this video, I'll be explaining how to stop bleeding from a wound. First off, you're going to need a first aid kit. It's usually red and has a cross on the side. Side. Now inside the kit, you will be able to find a few basic things. If not, they should be easily found around the house. For today, you need some gauze and plaster. The plaster will be used to seal the wood if mine. The gauze will be used to clean away the blood, exposing the wood for easier access. It will also be used to apply pressure to stop the bleeding. Make sure your hands are clean. This can be done by applying disinfecting solution. Jolina, don't touch your face. Your hands are very, very dirty. Go and take the hand sanitizer from my back, please. First, clean the blood away with sterile dressing until you can expose the injured area. After the blood is cleaned away, apply pressure to the wounded area for a short period of time until the bleeding stops. Now cover up the wound with a plaster to prevent any debris from getting inside. Most bleeding can be stopped even before the ambulance arrives at the scene. If left uncontrolled, bleeding may lead to shock or even death. That's all from me today. Remember, stay safe!